Hey. What a way to start the week. And hey, you. Yes, you watching. Why are you so gloomy? Put a smile on your face because right here on the show, we are about to make your day better. And we know you love good music, great <laughs> entertainment content, and we serve it best on this very show. Because if we don't give you, how would you take it? I don't know. Yes, rightly said. You are tuned into the very best launch hour show. And your Monday just went up from zero to 100. So if you want to join in and you are on the move, you can also watch us via our website, which is www.tvcentertainment.tv. Ladies and gentlemen, better recognize this Royal Anderson's Flanners. <laughs> I go by the name King OJ. Uh, boy, you could call me OJ. Uh, yeah, that's what it is. It is what it is. What happened to orange juice? Uh, that's uh. my government's name. <laughs> hey! hey. We don't do government names. Uh, is, right. that what we do? is that what we should do today? Yes, please. Yes, okay, please. Uh, you already know orange juice, OJ, orange juice. You get it? Get it? Yeah. That's what's up. Wow. That's my, government. That's my government name. Then okay. if, you, if you want to add my Spanish name, mm -hmm. it's called Emmanuel. 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 Okay. Thank I, you. I give up. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> all right, you all know my name. My name is Catherine, but you all know me as Lady Cat, a real hotness, Queen Cat, a real hotness, Kit Cat, Kitty Kata, Kate, Ovi Kate, Cruz. Thank we're you on the cruise. We're doing good men names. Thank you. Uh, okay, so my name is Catherine Bashwa Alimi. And Please don't is, twist your tongue. And, and this is the news at 12. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Catherine Bashwalimi and this, this is the news news. at noon. Okay. Uh, so it's how OJ did not add last name inside and yeah. That's no orange juice now. Ah, oh, no. Jesus. We know it's orange. Emmanuel, is it? So if you are running for presidency now, I want to buy you form. Yeah. I'll now say what name ah, shall I put on it. I'll now Dala? say orange. No, I, don't, I don't do I don't do that. Dala, did you see Ubi Franklin's post up? People say, oh, his name is not Ubi Franklin. <laughs> <laughs> that's how yeah. OJ's case will be. I, I think for Daily Top 5, we should do uh, five people that I think that that's their real name. <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> Girl, Dala, aka the goddess of skills. Some of you call me the goddess oh, yes. or da la 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 And um, for government name, because I know Jay's about to ask, yeah. my actual name is Oruwari, Dala, Kaine. and Kaine is my middle name. It's called pronounced Kaine. Kaine. Yeah, Kaine. it means small mother. Kaine. And that's small why mother. I will beat that's you. That's why she mommies you that's and you beat. That's why she's mothering you. But on it's the okay. Show. Small mother. It's all right. It's yeah. Monday. We will not subscribe to violence. <laughs> all right, guys. We are coming through with some excitement on the show today, as we will be sharing with you all what it is we got up to over the weekend. Check out some entertainment stories and, of course, celebrity birthday shout outs. Yes, there will also be a quick lesson of today in entertainment history on Rewind. We'll then check out our Man Crush Monday, while social review will be brought to us by Kaine. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing better than showing gratitude on the rid of segment as uh, we start the second part of the show. We'll also be taking the news recap in case you missed it and also checking out this weekend highlight of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Yes, yes, yes. And on today's Daily Top 5, we will be talking about five steps to be outrageously consistent and wrapping it all up on today's conversation on Truth Syndrome Monday. We will be asking if you were to go for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire game show with a Nigerian celebrity based on the person's intelligence, who would you go with and why? Hey! Wow. Hey. This one shook, yeah. but God, this keep one. watching to see more. <laughs> <laughs> yes, brand new one, ladies and gentlemen, from the African Giants himself, Burner Boy. Uh, mm -hmm. That one is titled Last Last. And it's crazy how that song is supposed to be a breakup song. But mm -hmm. we're dancing to it <laughs> like, hey, everybody, yeah. uh, we're having a rocket. Yeah, whatever, whatever <laughs> Steph London was trending, people went on that on the comment section on hmm. Twitter and Instagram, like, wait till you do our own Odogu. <laughs> you give our Odogu break. And she was just posting fashion, she was just posting her clothes, say, you she break, you them. break Bonaboy hat, Bonaboy the record song, but that's an amazing song, and yeah, he also I agree. performed at the Billboard Awards. Yeah! yeah. Appeared, appeared on the red carpet to Close perform. the show. Yeah, mm -hmm. performed, performed Last Last and Kilometer. Man, Nigerian music to the world, man. Yes. But yeah. make Unade care for sure, for the... I don't want to take off rubies. You talent for you, I shall go there. I'm not tired. That's why I keep saying. Except if Didi, the way Didi is uh, uh. to produce Bonaboy's right. album, mm -hmm. Didi or my uncle Sean, that's mm -hmm. Jay Z. 
will bring me out of retirement, then I'll probably do it. No problem. You already have the dress like Bonana. Look, he has the dress. Low budget, Bonana. He gets the swag. He don't even savvy the dance. Low budget, Daddy Shogi. Shall we continue? You're talking about legends there. So if nah, Daddy Shogi or Bonana. This is the low budget for me, Shall we? low budget. We go run. What other, what I got? At least I'm going to win at this. That's true. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for Over the Weekend. Time to find out what it is we got up to this past weekend. Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> who wants to go first? Where did I get up to? I can't remember Friday. Hmm. OJ. This hey. is why I like OJ to go first. Yeah, I, because I can't remember what? Friday. Okay. Yeah, Saturday, I, will I, I can remember that one because um, <laughs> shout out to um, the new joints uh, that opened up yeah. at uh, Lekki. Um, Amalaskai. They decided to host um, the East Splash Gang, even though some people were. MIA, they were missing in action. <laughs> so, I so, so, so I, I did only that. Like food, so I did Ka that. Catherine, betray. I did. I wow. Did. Eh? Went to Amalaska, I went to eat Amala, and I, <laughs> I took a risk. I've never done the yellow, the call it Begiri, 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 yeah. yeah. I just do Amala, what? whatever soup. Uh, uh, I took the risk by doing it, and I liked it. That was, what, that was what I did on Saturday. Um, watch football in between, but yeah. Uh, moving on, uh, we did <laughs> AMVC. Uh, check, uh, got caught up with AMVC, which was like everywhere. People were talking about it, the fashion, the people winning the award. We'll talk about that later. Which is yeah. Uh, that was Saturday. Then Sunday, watch a couple of movies. Then all up in the night, did the red carpet for the Billboard Music Awards. Streamed that one. Uh, when you said did the carpet, I was I like, thought you know, Abby. Abby. Oh, yeah. 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 What's out of my mouth? Uh, 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 watch, 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 yeah, back already. watch the red carpet. I wish one day God. From how do you say that? From God's ears to your from, from your lips, lips to, to his ears. ears. Lord, from my lips to your ears. Mm -hmm. Look at the host um, billboard red carpets, the Grammy red carpets. Aww. And because we don't pass AMVC and the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, do you want to go next? Yeah. Okay. So uh, this weekend, I don't know. Let me start from Saturday. So uh, Saturday. Sorry, Friday was a blow. Uh, my sister. <laughs> so Saturday, uh, I was doing Netflix and chill, and then ah. I went with OJ. Ah. Wait, 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 wait. wait. The Netflix Claire, and chill. Claire, no, it, no. Eh. Netflix and chill. Like the way I watch Netflix, watch with binge you? watching on my phone. Oh, That's yeah. not Netflix and chill. That's you know watch Netflix. Uh -uh. I cannot watch Net Netflix. Netflix, Netflix, Netflix and, and chill, chill is another thing. Oh action. yeah, oh me, I was watching Netflix on my own. Mm -hmm. Better. Uh -huh. And then <laughs> OJ and I went to eat some very good sumptuous amala uh -huh. with uh, the rest of the team, uh -huh. and it was nice. OJ is nice, so OJ is a nice boy. You got your nice... extra meat, Abby. That's why I was shouting ah, nice. OJ was my chauffeur. I uh -huh. just I just do that on Saturdays in the uh -huh. afternoon. <laughs> After the Friday the thirteenth. The Saturday that I come after, I get to be nice. Wow, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> but uh, I love the ambience. The space was very nice. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm Alaska, they did it well. Mm -hmm. Like, the food! Hmm. And then I had offer Wait, that this again. Is the same, this is the same Amala, um, the one that was in Ibadan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Oh, no, no, so it's an affiliate, yeah. Ooh, so it's okay. an affiliation. Look, I, I see, so, look at her. So I was uh, doing a video of wow. myself work, working out, and then... It looked planned by the time we're done with the video because I saw an old friend, someone I haven't seen since uni. Mm -hmm. So in the video, I was walking out and I hugged and when I watched it later, I was like, oh, okay. It was looking scripted, but <laughs> it wasn't scripted. Nah, nah. Like, Action. I haven't seen her in so many years. It looked scripted, sure. Yeah. It looked too scripted. <laughs> I, mean, I didn't know they were still recording, but it was so good to see her. Aww. Then he's stowing Thomas and then I met her son, the fine boy. Wow. Mommy, mommy, mommy. Yeah, after that, I went, I came back to the mainland after traveling for Amala. <laughs> then Sunday, I didn't go to church. I joined uh -uh. online. That's strange. I will not lie. I didn't go to church. I joined so online. So the school teacher. And <laughs> well, the children will be fine. I'm not the only teacher. <laughs> uh, <laughs> then uh, after that, I watched Netflix. I watched uh, Welcome to Eden. It's I saw it as well. It's not it bad. It's not bad, actually. Mm. It's not I bad. It as but well. what I didn't like was the fact that I could predict some things. Like, I just knew she wasn't going to leave because okay, I started to. No, it's not bad. No, I, apart, from, no apart from prediction, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. And then on Sunday, I took out my ex because I didn't want jelly again, and here I am back. Well, I thought you said you took out your ex. 
Ah. Okay, and that was my weekend, though. That's what I did. <laughs> 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 he don't jump me, Rich. Oh, yes, uh, nice one, though. Check out your ex. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. I don't double seven. Go, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, while low budget butter boy is uh, having wow. a moment wow, with himself, nice let me yes, thank you very much. Um, so on Friday, I just figured that uh, people don't really know what it what it's like uh, coming to work at TVC. So I said I was going to make a video. So I made a video um, that where the day Victoria was here, and then I posted that like how we get ready for work, mm -hmm. um, get on set, how the camera guys the are making you, and all that. Then like when the show starts, break time, and all of that. <laughs> I mean, it was actually uh, really fun. A lot of people liked it because I'm like, they only see us in yeah, front, I'm so it's nice to see like behind when we're struggling with it. Like, times, Dala, your audio, your audio, can Dala, you hear me? The lot behind when we go on break, she will go and be fighting people. Hey! I'm sorry, do I look like I fight? Do these okay. nails look like they're made for yeah. fighting? Oh, I don't think nails. so. Thank you. Mm. <laughs> Thanks to the yeah. shoes too. Um, so after that, I had a, um, I got an invite for, uh, well, Fenty Beauty, Rihanna's makeup line. They're coming to Nigeria um, and some other African like, countries as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I got an invite um, to the master class where they had her official makeup artist. His name is uh, Hector Espinal. Woo! And <laughs> yeah, so we had um, a class that he invited us to and then we got to see him do makeup on like models and all that. They were telling us about the new products and everything. Got to ask him a very interesting question, uh, which he replied to uh, so that was Friday um, Saturday was well, kind of a big day for me because it was like announcement day for the fact that um, creating content for <clears throat> creating content and influencing for uh, Fenty Beauty so they put me up on their page the content I created for them and I want to say thank you to everybody for all the messages all the Aww. love the lot of the yeah, out to the makeup section I go rub makeup for OG <laughs> but yeah that was that was the video that I did uh, the full thing is on my Instagram so you can go check that out but I mean it was it was actually really fun to do and uh, the launch is actually coming on like Children's yeah. Day so <laughs> the me and the my cash stylist done they set up As a, would that be one bag bag <laughs> Bouncing Castle. Mm. This is Children's, Children's Day now. All right, no problem. <laughs> um, so uh, that was uh, Saturday. Then I had a wedding to go for. It was a family friend's wedding. Um, you guys know my mom That's is back. Chop my, my mom is back hey. in, in Lagos. So uh, we went for the wedding. Uh, my dad too was there. Um, my my hey. too was there. It was a very fun wedding. Like, don't ask you drink two kilos. Ah, they said, the MC was saying, water, if you came here water. with your liver, that you are messed she's up. It's water, it's water she's talking about, by the way. Yeah, you said? Water, water. And I call out But drink. me, I, me, I just woke up now. I don't okay, drink yeah. anything. That's my own business. But they yeah. just try to announce for people. But it was one guy like this. The guy, uh, he's going to go holiday. <laughs> so that was that. And then... Um, Sunday, we know you didn't go to church. Sunday... I mean, Sunday was just chilled. Yeah. Let, me, let me put it like that. Sunday was a rest day for me. Aww. What day with the lack of condition? I said, on Sunday, I decided to time Go to Do you think I actually tell you guys mm. everything I, I do? Mm. It's highlight. Mm. Oh, I give you queen highlight. of highlights. Mm. Yes. All right, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it is a wrap on over the weekend. The entertainment news is up next. <laughs> Hey, all right, we know we always give you an overdose of entertainment right here on this show. And that's a brand new video titled Overdose. Really, yeah, really nice, colorful. The Mavens, they always do us proud. Yeah. I think I, I think what's at is just the this Friday, all of them. I see. Plus the little drama that happened with the topping the iTunes Ugh. charts. Bonaboy drops, David Doe drops, the whiskey dropped, uh, the bands dropped. White uh, money. Dro white money, money dropped. dropped. Uh, mm -hmm. The Mavens dropped, like virtually everybody dropped. So it was now competition. Uh, DJ Spin on Ashaket dropped. Yeah, so it was now dropped. a competition of who is stopping. The, 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 no, the, the, the one person uh, screenshot what, is number one. You know, double O one. For, for not for nothing. Double O one. The other one. The other one. The other one that took over number one was not laughing. We're not laughing. Not downloaded all the songs except. The former number one. Ah. Okay, uh, yeah, shout out, shout out ah. to the Mavens, man. Uh, that's Ira Star. This, this particular video, Ira Star, Magix, Laddie Po, um, Boy Spice, Crayon. Yeah, yeah but sets. I wanted to see... I know, I know, I wanted to see Rema and Johnny. It was in the video. It was in the car. Uh, it, was <laughs> it was a video visit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right about now, we're moving on to the entertainment news, and we're starting with this one. Big winners at the Africa Magic Viewers' Choice Awards AMVCA. It was indeed a night of glitz and glamour at the 8th edition of the AMVCA, which held over the weekend at the prestigious Eco Hotels in Lagos. 
The event, which was hosted by IK Osaki Odua and South African media personality Bonang Mathiba, witnessed the attendance of various celebrities as well as movie stars receiving their honors. Some of the big winners on the night include Stan Nze, who won the Best Actor in a Drama category for Rattlesnake, The Hannah Story. While Osaz Igodaro also won the Best Actress in a Drama category for the same movie, Rattlesnake, The Ahana Story. The Best Actress in Comedy, Movie, TV series went to Funke Akindele Bello for Omogeto the Saga, while Brother Shaggy won the Best Actor in Comedy, Movie, TV series for his role in Dwindo. Odolade Adekola won the Best Supporting Actor category for Jankariwo, while Omaomi Dada won a role in uh, Country Hard and the Best Supporting Actress category. Other winners on the night include Mr. Funny, aka August Sabinos, who won the newly introduced Best Online Social Content Creator category, while the Trailblazer Award went to Nigerian actress and producer Teniola Aladeshe. Ramsey Noah won the Best Director category for Rattlesnake The Ahana Story, while the Best Overall Movie category went to Amina, and the Industry Merit Award went to Tyro Ajayi Lyset, amongst other winners. Yeah, a big congratulations to all of them. All of them. Um, got to see some parts of the show. Got to see the fashion ah. as well. Fashion which, took which, over. Which, which, which I had a problem. Which, I which, problem which with. yeah, which I had a problem with. I, I, I even tweeted and I was like, some of these outfits are stressing it's me out. <laughs> see, there was there was even a theme. You know, there was a. Did you know there, oh, was, there was a theme? theme? Oh, yeah, there was there was a there was heritage something that ah. nobody everybody just came we, and gave us bridal train as well, but that's wow. not where yeah. Uh, for fashion show <laughs> talk about. That yeah, why, 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 why yeah. I said I have a problem because it's crazy how this whole idea was to reward actors, producers, movie yeah. stars, mm -hmm. and all that. And people were talking more about the fashion. Yeah, true. So I yeah. think I think we actually need a fashion show that would just like a Met Gala, strictly fashion. Yeah, because some people yeah. were just trendy unnecessarily, like. Can we talk even, about Stan even, Ize? even more Stan, than the winners, yes, yeah. Yes. Can we talk about Stan Ize winning or Osas Godaro winning or Ramsey Noah winning like or Rattlesnake just come in and packing up their words? Yes. 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 It's now it's now, yes. now see wait to this one where? This one called the fight. My cloth is hundred thousand dollars. Dollars. If you don't have ten thousand, style is called a drag. Another person you, say, you pay know. half material. You I know so it's, well. I know pay you. I know. It's which it's I think it's, and, and, and I agree. This is, should even be a rant, but today is Monday. Yeah. <laughs> because at the end of the day, it did take away from yes. the fact that yes, it did. there were people like who had put in work in yeah. the celebrating, mm -hmm. and then. Uh, yeah, me, I'm just happy for the winners. That's what yeah, I'm gonna yeah. say. Yes. Um, I didn't see anybody that won anything that would say, "Oh, this is questionable." I feel like everybody deserved. Everybody had put yeah. in the work for yeah, what they yeah. did. Even, Even August I mean, yeah, Sabino, that, that was very controversial because yeah. I saw a lot of people saying, "Oh, wow, macaroni. he should mm. have been another person. He should have seen." I don't see a problem with him winning. In fact, no. all the nominees, and a shout out to the AMVCA people because I feel yeah. like they even picked the right people. Yeah. Yes, because there wasn't yeah. any category that was like, "Who is this person? Why is this yes. person?" Here? Was, there was none of that. Word. So. Yeah. Congrats to all of them. And then I also love the fact that uh, Mr. Macaroni came mm -hmm. out to say that, yes, it was a well-deserved win. Mm -hmm. Yes. And every nominee Before is a winner. Starts. Yes, because people go, they drag something on top of your head. You know they fight, they happy <laughs> fight. It's I mean, just crazy. And this, this is people that still evil too. Are the ones that still come and say, why did this person mm -hmm. win? Or must stay for your house. Thanks. Anyway, congratulations yeah, shout, to out, shout out to Ramsey Noah, by the way, who are supposed to be my favorite all-time Nigerian actor. Are you serious? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. And now he's winning. Uncle he's, 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 ah. <laughs> he's winning as a director. And I think he did yeah. that with Living in Bondage. And now we're Rattlesnake Diana's story. Yeah. Massive, That's growth massive right there. One. All right, moving on to the next story. Britney Spears suffers miscarriage. Month after announcing that she's expecting a baby with her fiance, Sam Asgari, singer Britney Spears has revealed that she has unfortunately lost the child. She made this known in a joint statement with Sam on her Instagram page with a post that had the write up on a quote. It is with our deepest sadness we have to announce that we have lost our miracle baby early in the pregnancy. This is a devastating time for any parents. Perhaps we should have waited to announce until we were further along. However, we're overly excited to share the good news. Our love for each other is our strength. We'll continue trying to expand our beautiful family. 
We are grateful for all the support. We kindly ask for privacy during this difficult moment, end quote. If you recall, the couple got engaged in September last year, days after her father filed a request to end the conservatorship. Uh, the singer had told the court that she wanted to marry Asgari, but under the conservatorship, she wasn't even allowed to. If you recall, in March, Britney Spears announced that she was having a baby, a first with fiancé Sam Asgari. Already, the singer is a mother of two teen sons, Sean and Jaden, with her ex-husband, Kevin Federline. Yeah, very sad one. Um, I, I feel like Britney is going through a lot, has been yes, going through a lot. Is. And, I mean, because Acting even... Acting too. Sorry? Acting awkward. Because she has been posting some um, revealing pictures on Instagram. Well, yeah, That's making I mean, people so, wonder, so like, let me, everything. Okay, so let me say this. You know how they say pastor's children, when they release them? Mm -hmm. She's been under conservatorship. Yeah. Do you understand? So now it's like freedom. Some free, there's, so there's a freedom, plus you know the fact that she, she is struggling with some yeah. mental issues. Yeah. There's a fact of that. But then on the side, um, I mean, coming out of this conservatorship and then now losing a child, like, it's back-to-back, hey, -back, like, tra us, yeah, it's back-to-back -back tragedy. And uh, what I'll say is, um, her family, they haven't particularly been very supportive, because either yeah. one person is yeah. releasing book yeah. and telling mm -hmm. the story of what's or happening, or one person is trying to rip, rip out, yeah. do you understand? So I'm happy that she has this person who she says yeah. is her strength, yeah. and then I just hope that she gets better. This is very sad, but we wish the best for Britney. Yeah, yeah I just, I wish them the very best, and uh, it's obvious that... Britney is not happy, but I just hope that she gets better. Everything gets better very soon. I just hope so. All right. Hmm. All right, that's all we can take on the entertainment news. It is now time for celebrity birthday shout out. First on our list in alphabetical order, we have Ajebo, who is 35 today. The Nigerian stand-up comedian, MC, and musician is known for infusing cartoons into his style of comedy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah you've definitely, you definitely seen Happy Ajibu. birthday. Ajibu. Happy, birthday. Yeah, happy <laughs> birthday. Also, we have Danny Trejo, who is 78 today. Yeah. The American actor is best known for movies like Desperado, Heat, From Dust Till Dawn movie series. Grindhouse, Anaconda, Sky Kids series, and many others. It's machete it's, for me. Yeah. Uh, like, that's it. That's who and, always and, and is. And I think that character came from Spy Kids, yeah, and they now yeah. gave him his and own series to, to be. So they can't cut last of an hour. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, in Nigeria, we call it machete. Yeah. yeah. But it's called machete. It's called class. Yeah. yeah. About machete. That? <laughs> machete. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday. All right, people. Janet Jackson is 56 today. Wow. She is an award-winning American singer, songwriter, actress, dancer, and also the 10th and youngest child of the Jackson family. She's one of the world's best-selling pop music artists, having sold over 100 million records. She has amassed an extensive catalog with singles such as Nasty, Rhythm Nation, That's the Way Love Goes, Together Again, and All For You, amongst others. And yes. I must say, she is pretty for days. She is... Yep. The energy, our music, everything. It's just there. It's just, it's great. Mm -hmm. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday. All right, guys. We also have Joseph Morgan, who is 41 today. The British actor and director is best known for his role as Niklaus Klaus Michelson on the CW's The Vampire Diaries and its spin-off, The Originals. Yeah, I think he's just sick to doing vampire movies because he kills it, I swear. He, he, he looks the part. Like, yeah. yeah. The, it's now, so, yeah. yeah. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> <laughs> All right, people. So, Megan Fox is 36 today. Wow. She's an American actress and model who has made multiple appearances in major film franchises, including the Transformers franchise, Jennifer's Body, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, 
Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows, New Girl, amongst others. Yeah, I definitely loved her when she was cast in uh, teen Teenage, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> happy birthday to her stunning actress, and she's so beautiful. And an awkward relationship. Or yeah, uh, let's, 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 let's leave it. Mas Ma 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 yeah, but okay. I love it. I love you. We drink each other's blood, sorry. Uh, it's <laughs> love, it's <laughs> love. Let's yeah, go. love coming out. <laughs> happy birthday. <laughs> we also have P.S. Brosnan, who is 69 today. The award-winning Irish actor and film producer is best known as the fifth actor to play secret agent James Bond in the Bond film series from 1995 to 2002, starring in four films, Golden Eye, Tomorrow Never Dies, The World Is Not Enough, and Die Another Day. He also starred in other films like Mamma Mia, The Ghost Ride, Percy Jackson and the Olympians, The Lightning Thief, the November Man, the Mamma Mia sequel, Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again, amongst many other films. Yeah, my he favorite, was one of my, my favorite James Bond. Thank yes. you. Thank you. Yes. No, I'm saying that he's one no of my favorite James Bond. No, Sean Connery, the no, Sean Connery, Connery but... legend. Yeah. But he, yeah. he, he definitely is. looked the role and killed the role. What about Daniel Craig did? Yeah. I don't Daniel Craig did. And then he's the switch from me. straight face to that cute smile like, hey, I got you. And he'll snatch your babe. <laughs> As he... <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday to him. Also on our list today, we have Thomas Brody Sangster, who is 32 today. He's an English actor known for playing the role of Judge and Reed on the drama series Game of Thrones. He also stars as Newt in the Maze Runner film series and voice John Tracy in Thunderbirds A Go. Yeah, I loved him in Game of Thrones. Yeah, yeah I did. Stellar Happy performance. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. All right, people, Vincent Regan is 57 today. He's a British actor best known for his roles in 300, Troy Unleashed, Clash of the Titans, Lockout, Snow White and the Huntsman, Dark Encounter, Empire, amongst others. Happy I, I, birthday. I, I, I think the kiss with him is typecast. Yeah. Because there's always all those Roman all warriors. Those, yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, but he does look Everything. like he belongs in that era, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. So very yeah. <laughs> because now if you saw him in comedy, I'd just be like, yeah, excuse me, where's your son? Well, yeah. <laughs> Let's where's fight. Your... I Carry need to on. kill somebody. And, and, that's, and that's the problem mm. with people who are typecast. Mm -hmm. if you, like uh, the new Batman. Mm -hmm. OJ still can't get it out of his head. Like, how? Yeah, that's Robert yeah. Pattinson. it happens. All right, happy birthday to them all and happy birthday to every single person celebrating today. Today's your special day. We wish you the very best and we hope that this is the beginning of great things in your life. Preach. Hey, Amen! Amen! Wow. Amen! Oh, God. Sorry, Sunday service, you not do, do it here. Yes, yeah. ma'am. No <laughs> problem, I'm watching you. <laughs> All right, guys, up next, a trip down memory lane on Rewind and, of course, our Man Crush Monday. Watch, 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 watch this. Let's rewind. On this day in 1984, when Dove's Cry, a single released by Prince Rogers Nelson, it went on to win the Billboard Song of the Year. And in 2002, Star Wars Episode II, Attack of the Clones, directed by George Lucas, starring Ellen McGregor, Hayden Christensen and Natalie Portman, opens in cinemas. Anakin. And finally, in 2019, Rocket Man, the film based on life of the singer Elton John, starring Taron Egerton, premieres at the Cannes Film Festival. And that's it. Watch, 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 watch this. It's Man Crush Monday, and today we're crushing on Pato Rankin. Pato Rankin is an Nigerian reggae dancehall singer and songwriter who attended Citizen Comprehensive College in Ekwe, Lagos, and later enrolled at Jibril Martin Memorial Grammar School in Iponri and started his performing arts career as a street jam and carnival dancer. Pato Rankin, who signed a record deal with K Solo Zibiraga Records in 2010, releasing Up in the Club under the outfit, became a protege of Dem Mama Records after collaborating with Timaya on his song Alubarika, a song Pato Rankin described as a summary of his life as a musician, saying it opened doors for him in terms of building a fan base and working with established musicians. By 2014, Pato Rankin signed a record deal with Foster Music and ended his affiliations with Dem Mama Records. It was under this record label who released the Wheezy Pro produced track, Golio, and later the remix featuring Tiwa Savage. The remix
remix helped draw attention to Pataranki's music and his catalog grew over the next few years, with various singles and a slew of guest appearances on songs by other artists, including vocal sports and Shay Shay's hit Murder, Kulichana's No Lie and many others. Featuring collaborations with Elephant Man, Sakodie and others, his debut full-length God Over Everything arrived in 2016 and debuted at number four on Billboard's Reggae Albums Chart. That same year, Pato Rankin joined on as one of the judges for the freshly launched televised singing competition, The Voice Nigeria, while he continued to release singles throughout the years, including Love You Die, Major Lazer's Particular, and by May 2019, Pato Rankin issued his sophomore album on his own label, Amari Music, a label he named after his newborn daughter, Wilma, who he has also featured on its cover. The album included the singles Confirm, featuring Davido and Lenge Lenge, which reached number five on the Billboard Reggae Albums chart. Now here are five things we do not know about Pato Rankin. His real name is Patrick Naimeka Okore. In a 2012 interview, he said his stage name was given to him by a Jamaican artist whom he met at Alpha Beach in Lagos. The name is a combination of, wait for it, Pato, a short version of his name Patrick, and Rankin, which is the Jamaican slang for someone that is highly respected. Hence, Pato Rankin. Pato Rankin has cited Buju Banton, Bob Marley, Felakuti, Loki Dube, Chaka Demis, Magic Fashek, Blackie, Blackface, Two-Face and Marvelous Benji as his key musical influences. The singer describes his music as a morally inclined variation of dancehall and says it references social political issues. Before breaking into music, Mr. Pato Rankin, who was a dancer at street jams and carnivals, sold rat poison and worked as a bricklayer to make ends meet. Meaning, if you persevere and remain consistent, you will one day be rewarded. For all this and more reasons, we love Pato Rankin, and he is our man crush today. Pato Rankin right there, our man crush for today. Ooh. Um, fascinating how he was selling rat poison and doing bricklayer work mm -hmm. and then became an artist. And then he blow. He just to show you that anything that you are doing. Oh, that it's career. It's yeah. Oh, that it's career that you're looking at. Come out of retirement. In the music industry. Give it to us. Come out of retirement. Yes. We see it. Receive! Why, love? And we don't want you. <laughs> Alright, guys, it is time once again for your daily dose of laughs. Welcome to Social Veil. Are, are we talking about a kitchen blessing or Corel BD? Please, I don't hear about no, pints today. It's like what we are talking Corel about BD? people I don't hear about money. pints today. Corel BD, go. I don't hear about pints because she's always wearing pints. <laughs> so you see, wow. the pints matter. Yeah. What are the people that owe you money? Somebody said, well, once wants you to get back with your husband. She's not there. Eh, like, eh. it's not that serious. Snake dance. I was like, I was nasty wearing pants. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh... Um, this person is with some wisdom right here, and the person is saying, I'll be naming my daughter pregnant. So uh... when a guy meets her, the guy will say hi, and she'll say, hi, I'm pregnant. Case closed. Wow. <laughs> this is wisdom. Wow. Okay, don't laugh because you can do it. I go best. It's something else you can do. <laughs> and I go, if, if I, I am... I am pregnant. <laughs> All right, uh, later. <laughs> Not yeah. need to ask for number. Oh my God. Not to talk. But why can't you still collect a number? That child might need a father. <laughs> the Lord has said to me Except that she will are, get a father. Except if you are Rihanna or you are Megan the Star, uh, or you are... Uh... Oh, has double standards. I swear. <laughs> but it's okay. Case closed. Okay, uh, so this question, I've actually asked this, but I'm happy that it's here today. They said, who actually sat down and said heartbreak should be called <laughs> breakfast? Because whenever you say heartbreak, I think the word used to hit yeah. whim. So they took the break at the end and said breakfast. You were said. Yeah, I, I, yeah. and I, th I, think, I think it was from a Yoruba actor, or Yoruba, Yoruba film, I think his name is Ogogo, if I'm not mistaken. That, that's where that Gogo Alamaje breakfast. Uh, I think that's where that thing came from. Gogo Alamaje breakfast. What's that? All of us go chop breakfast. Last, last, according to Bonner Boy. Why wouldn't him? Where did he get it? So, it just, so maybe from catching you know his explanation they drop of that, lamba. Break, that breakfast, then Yoruba actors will just come out to Lamba like okay. Gogo now, lamba Alamaje now. breakfast. Oh, they don't okay, save so you. So, me, me. I, what I thought along the line is that, you know, because, you know, lovers wake up in the morning, they're giving you breakfast in oh. bed. <laughs> that's what me, I thought. Oh. That, oh, you won't chop breakfast. You eat breakfast. Okay, you see, okay, you see we're so different. So, as in, then, yeah. so we don't actually know the real place. But that boy that sang breakfast in a national... He should come and explain to us. Yes. Wait, Even Bonner Boy now and uh, Steph Lord should Steph explain to us. But mm. it's okay. Um, this person here is called at Too Much Drags. Uh, and the person <laughs> is saying to us that can't dance, 
what are we supposed to do on our wedding day? I asked myself this question this weekend. Yeah. <laughs> At dollar for Agba Kosi said, it's called one legged, <laughs> one legged like this. Bounce, bounce it. it. See? Bounce, bounce it. it. Hey. <laughs> then you switch the leg. So if you guys don't know, there's this guy that has this whole dance video that's yeah, like yeah, African yeah. dance. Yeah. One, one leg like, one like this. Your hands like this. Your hands like this. Facial and expression. You know, and gestures. You know how you give it up now? No, I, 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 crazy thing, uh, at King OJ1 on TikTok, I jumped on it. Yeah, wow. I jumped on it, so go and check my one leg. Wow, okay. Okay. Bounce it. This your one, bounce it. Bounce Did you bounce it? Yeah. Uh, this is once in a year posting. Go to King OJ1 on TikTok. We, and tell me we really did. appreciate it. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> As DKNL underscore is saying, Ill illegal immigrants go faint for Bonaboy MSG concert. That's Madison Square Garden. Next place, she open her eye, Naikorodu. Hmm. Uh, Major Odogo now replied with Anywhere I go, Mola Tipada Sile me. Wow. Mola Tipada Sile me. So you want to bring Mola Boy song into this conversation? Well, they so this anywhere they go. Boy's concert. So, anywhere you so go, you home is still home. home. Come All right. Some people don't like that. I don't, I don't understand that painting in concerts. And I asked myself this question. When that Michael Jackson uh, thing I came think. out that time, that people were painting, I'm like, why not wake up? You've missed the whole concert. <laughs> <laughs> you don't miss the main show. I don't really understand the yeah. painting. It was awkward when it was happening and other African countries, people were fitting from yeah, P square to and their legs. You, you paid money to go and so meet not the show. Faint. They're like, is there no artist that you want to see that you might probably just lose Wait. it? Okay, let's do lose it. Lose what? <laughs> Lose your manners. Uh, yeah, like, the she, see, there plenty? Huh? There's no plenty. There's it's, no artist. But wait, it's one. Gonna boy. It's but where is one. the sense? It's where is the sense in buying tickets? And then you miss. Faint. Why not wait till the end? Then you go, ah, I'm faint. It comes, it doesn't, it doesn't have time. So it's uh, like when you go to service and the old, you don't phone before. You don't phone before. Into where? <laughs> temptation. This game now, which? Into temptation. I'm a me. I go ahead. I go ahead. Bought the guy. Keep on. Uh uh. I will blow your own back. You too. <laughs> don't struggle with the spirit. Don't struggle. But you know those guys they actually supposed to push you. Yes, now. Nah. Okay. Me, I go. That's give why they thought the forehead. I know they were passers. Passers. They watch the show. Ah. Okay. Uh. Tefa T J. Is saying, I grew up on Mosley Road, Ikoi. One day, after a particularly arduous episode, my eight year old self decided I wanted to run away. I packed a bag, and my grandma wished me ah. Johnny Messis. Ah. I think I got as far as Global Road before I turned back. <laughs> Grandma's laughter still echoes in my head. <laughs> she then look, you say, Yeah. Where are you going, my yeah. darling? <laughs> you so come back I, home. I think growing up, you were. One had that episode that you'd be like, I yeah. don't think I'm from this family. Yeah. I need to leave. Yeah, we all did. Was, yeah. We all did. I saw a, a, a video of his baby that, I don't know, maybe they scolded or something. She was packing her pink school bag. Yes, like, I saw that one. You're so cute. But, but, my, this one they go. but my own is my grandmother will even beg me. Uh, you know? Oh, you, so, they will beg you. No, yeah, grandma, my no me, my own grandmother that year, she will not beg you. She will help you. Oh, what do you need? <laughs> <laughs> she will make your back heavy. Why are you ah. still like, I'm going like this. <laughs> <laughs> you go out. Ha. That man and boy song enter yet. Sooner. As well. As in, right where you go, you, you go come, come back home. home. Very no wonderful. I don't know the scam. Nah, scam. <laughs> All right. So Shirley is asking a question, and she says, "Please, why do Nigerians always say sorry before asking you for a favor or asking for directions?" As Afro <laughs> VII now replied, same reason you said please wow, nice in this sentence. Exactly, yeah. you said please it. before question. Yeah. So I think this is the reason why. I think that we're very angry people. Yeah. We are on the list Legit. of happy people, but we're also very angry people at the same time. So do you know that sometimes because you are driving car that is fine, I want to ask somebody walking for direction. You have to tell them you. sorry. You. No, you have to tell <laughs> please them sorry. I'm sorry. So that sorry is yes. Ah, don't use that because. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. I'm going to. Some people you even I... use both. Sorry, my sister, please, can you tell me how to get to? Oh, unless you want to be like all those Jamaican films that like yeah. you just wind down and say, Yeah, I'm going to. And the they say, Show me! <laughs> like, yeah, Nigeria. I shout out to people that will actually give the right description. Yeah. Not one that will say, Oh, the one that you now ask, please, I'm going to. Ah! Is that what that. Ah! Ah! Excuse me. Just, just, it means you are Miss Rodney. Ah! When I hear that thing, I'll just say, God in heaven. <laughs> You go, go to... Okay, where so where you are you coming from? Okay, coming where do you pass? <laughs> you know that? <laughs> then, you know that? When you are coming, do you see where they are selling suya? You will not read jail. I you will not go left. I you are... Uh, okay, and finally, please. You don't um, lost. The people that actually say there's nowhere like that around here. If you are not sure, please keep quiet. Yeah. Because
because you just made me feel like I just yeah. just say oh I don't know. Don't say oh there's nowhere like that around oh, I've here. Not heard so of map where carry me reach where they map the crease <laughs> where the satellite. Okay. Okay. Although map don't carry me face wall before. Before the go, go straight. In <laughs> three hundred, three hundred where. No, even like say when they do the map, that place still they straight. They no, never said the no, land. They don't go be. They never said the land. Mm -hmm. So they sell so land place. where road day. Um. <clears throat> At uh, Fatima, uh, at Olori Feikemi, <laughs> is saying, ask me anything. Oh, and then, you know those poses that they used to Russia. give? One legged. Those, yeah, one legged. One legged. Uh, at Oproko <laughs> Doctor, who is stressing everybody, the, today he was doing it, so yeah, you have cancer, something. Did, but, right. ah. It's okay. And I said, a, he said, ask me anything. He said, a 74-year-old patient is hospitalized with a right middle cerebral hey. artery stroke. The cathode duplex reveals a stenosis of 55% of the ipsilateral cathode artery. In a few words, Stop. explain why you would carry a cathode and directectomy or this patient. Or this patient. <laughs> Please ask my doctor. Okay. That's the answer. So, okay. you know, you could have just asked the girl, why are you standing like this? <laughs> but she said, ask me anything. So the question is, why are you standing like this? No, ask me anything. Or is this your best this what he this wrote This is all problem. Here. This is all problem. What he wrote here, the... the the question is, yeah. why are you standing like this? But it's his own problem. Like, who wants a free kick? <laughs> 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 this is our best pose. So, so be careful, be careful. Do you know how many likes she yes. Be careful what you put up on Twitter. Exactly. Because yeah. I'm sure after mm -hmm. Aproko Doctor did this, a lot of people will be going on there and be asking irrelevant, tough questions. Ask me any, I'll, I'll, I think I'll tweet it today. Ask me anything. You are going to feel it. It's all ah, right. La, la. <laughs> and I'll give them a picture that I'm taking free kick like this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> okay, um, I, IBK Sports is saying, I love the way my church focused, uh, invited a, well, focus group invited a doctor to come and talk on genotype today instead of the usual preaching. <gasps> One member asked why he's AA and his wife is AS and their daughter is SS. And doctor said, daughter isn't his own. Church, don't scatter. Hey, like, well, hey. I, saw, I saw this tweet yesterday. I saw um, it too. I don't want to believe this. <laughs> You ah. don't believe it? Like, this is a disaster. All right. Ah. This is a disaster. Should it, should, should, and you cannot lie in the presence of the Lord. I mean, no, the see, let me explain to you guys. You know, so there you are people... So you just jump out the yes. OJ, you know there are people that Actually. would say, I was AS, and I was praying to the Lord, and he changed my genotype to AS. So maybe when he yeah. was still AS was when she got pregnant. Oh, that's yeah. the excuse she will use. Nice one. <laughs> and the Lord changed it. Yeah. Lord. And, and, and it's, it's funny that we're saying this now, because I'm watching a documentary where the doctor... He's a gynecologist and then he also like fertility doctor. So mm. apparently he was getting women pregnant with his using his own ah. DNA. Yeah. yeah. And then found out that at the end, like by the time the documentary was done, he had maybe like ninety something children. children. And the mothers all didn't know that he was the donor. So they start having problems, all of the children. It's a long story. Wow. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll finish that and let you guys know. Yeah, yeah and uh, that's mission accomplished on the first half of the show. But not to worry, we are still loaded to get ready for Truth Syndrome Monday. And in case you missed the question earlier, we oh asked. Oh, God. Hmm. <laughs> if you were to go for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire game show with a Nigerian celebrity based on the person's intelligence, who would you go with <laughs> and Zazu. why? Zay. Zazu. What is Zay? Zazu. I'll take Zazu. <laughs> yeah, you take Zazu too. Yes, sir. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's still your favorite top notch entertainment show, East Splash. In case you're wondering, yours sincerely, my name is OJ. I'm in the building. Da la 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 it's now time to chew it up, ladies and gentlemen. Time for one of us to be grateful because it is Gratitude Monday. Can it be me? Yes, yeah. my darling. Lord, you know I'm grateful, Sean. Yeah, I'm very grateful, Lou. All right. You will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my gratitude today is um, for the people who um, love you as you are. Yeah. Who love you as you are? Yeah. <laughs> so that OJ can understand. Yeah. I understand um, that. So I've always wanted to be um, 
a break from the norm. Wow, why does that sound? <laughs> that sounds familiar. Let, let me, no, 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 let me rephrase. So I've always been the kind of person that I never want to do things the way everybody else is doing it. I just feel like that's boring. And then I remember when I started doing like really crazy makeup, really crazy eyebrows and all that. And you know, I have people that always say, ah, this is this thing. Why are you doing it like this? Ah, and then for a while, I actually stopped doing it because I was like, okay, is it too About much? To is it? Yeah. So I was like, is it too much? Is it this? Is it that? Even when I started this show, I would see DM. Somebody actually said, oh, are you seeing how the other people on the show are doing their makeup? Can't mm -mm. you do your makeup? My man, I'm like, I'm passing. I came so by what? myself, so please, to this world, and I will go by myself. Uh, so fast forward to um, this week when the whole. Um, uh, when uh, OJ's. Boo decided <laughs> to launch. Launch in Nigeria. Please, she has a name. When Rihanna Robin. decided to launch in Nigeria, <laughs> and um, we had the master class, and then so I had to ask a question. So um, I asked the question to Rihanna's makeup artist, and then he was like, "Girl, your makeup is giving." It was it was the confidence okay, yeah. booster. I didn't even know that you I needed. Mean. And that day, when I was about to do my makeup for um, the event, my mind, I was like, ah, should I do normal makeup? Let's not be like mom is much. I said, you know what, girl, go all out. So I gave them the food, the liner, the eyebrows were here. <laughs> the address <laughs> they give them. And the fact that he liked it, he just said a lot. Yeah. Not everybody is going to love you mm -hmm. the way you are. Yeah. And then sometimes he'll surprise you that the people you don't even expect. Even he was like, oh my God, girl, your nails, woo, serving. And then it just, for me, it's a thing where, Find the people. Uh, look the nails. <laughs> this one, this one goes scratch for you. Ah, you find you can't trouble. Scratch. Oh, but yeah, so it's a, it's, it, for me, it's just being grateful for the people that love you how you are. The people that don't try to change you. Mm -hmm. The people that don't say everybody is doing this thing A B C. Why yeah, are you yes. doing your own D K M? Why can't you also do A B C? Yeah. Like be able to stand out from the crowd. Be able to. Cause I honestly feel like if I wasn't myself. Yeah. I would never be the first bald influencer for Fenty Beauty mm -hmm. in Nigeria. Yeah. It would That's never have way. happened if I was saying, oh, let me look normal, let me this, let me that. No. Like, so if you want to be crazy, see, be crazy. It's craziness that is working. Nigerian uh, Nigerian brands now don't look me say this guy. Wait till you but they you want, want. See, you'll be all right. Mm. Because see, it's like when I cut my hair, never tell anybody in my house. True. I remember my mom say, ah, if you cut your hair, you will look like Amber Rose. I said, eh. Hey. I just went to the saloon. I never tell her anything. I just, as I entered the house, I remember that day. My dad calls me the girl. I didn't even tell him anything. As I came down from the car, I said, the girl, the boy. <laughs> So, I mean, it's just that thing where, because I've had people tell me, oh, uh, and I've said it before on the show, yeah. hey, did you cut your hair because your husband died? Ah, I hope it's not because of fashion. No. Okay, as you don't talk finish now, <laughs> did Rihanna notice you? No. I didn't no. pay you. No. Uh, did you understand? So, where, where, so where, where I'm going with this gratitude? They're yeah, yeah, paying yeah. you. So, we're, very, we're very happy. Mm. Okay, what do you want? I don't like how you're lunch. touching me. What do you uh, want? Uh, it's free food there at Yabola. There's fried rice. At Mrs. Day, free food. Yes, nah. So, yeah, so then that's you, what your plan. Um, um, hot spots from that. You are a thief. Ah, <laughs> OJ! OJ did not even do... OJ yeah. has aunt I. Did not even do part school oh, no. on the road, because, though. Because you went... it's, my, it's my boo that assigned you to be... Yeah. That's money, that's... Wait, I know, can, that's can, I, can I ask you a question? I know, must be giving you a boo money. Can I ask a question, yeah. please? Did you send Rihanna. anything for him? No, no. She's pregnant. Will you rub saying. lip gloss? She sent me lip gloss. Yes, ordinary lip gloss. It's transparent. No, you're not Very transparent. You don't support your baby. <laughs> At all. This is my problem with Nigerian men. I'll use the perfume. Let's not do this. <laughs> hey, where, where is this man from? Uh, well, we're, yeah. happy, we're happy for you. And yeah, yeah I, 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 I get it. Even when Denola uh, stepped on stage to collect I'm someone, so happy for he him. made a mention of something like that. But yeah, we, okay, yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. Well, you get the way you go drum, shall I? Me, they don't go move you. Anyway, me and the Chris, shall I? Let me just announce it once more. Had a Chris, and if you don't like me like that, I'm going to your school bag, put them for back. Carry the thing like this. So, at, at Goddess of Skills on yes, Instagram. Yes, so. And that's not But uh, search for Goddess of Skills. Yeah, well, I actually, Goddess of Skills. She has money now. Uh, you say? They pay in dollars. Dala, you say? That's one. Dala, we're coming for you. And then yeah, I love the home. video compilation you did of oh, your, your you. skills. So it's more like, allow me to introduce myself. You understand? Yeah. So, so if they don't get it, now they get it. And if they don't see get it, they forget, forget about, about it. it. Thank you very much. <laughs> All <God> right, <laughs> people. <laughs> Here's a quick recap of what we talked about in the news earlier. 
We told you that we have big winners at the African Magic Viewers Choice Awards AMVCA. That it's on to fashion show. And of course, we <laughs> talked about this one. Britney Spears suffers miscarriage. Sad one right there. Yeah. But right now, let's check out what went down this weekend on who wants to be a millionaire after this commercial break, guys. Amazing. So, Audrey should have been there because Audrey actually yeah. knew the answer yes, to that. Yes, she did. She <laughs> did. Audrey, after watching. And, and, and this is what inspired Audrey, the TSM question for today. If I had today. to pick a Nigerian celebrity based on intelligence, I take you, man. <laughs> wow, you're not the only one just taking OJ, Just that one. Bless, bless oh, only that one. Bless Dala. You better say you don't want cash out. Dala. <laughs> now you go answer 1 to 15. Now only number 16 OJ go answer. <laughs> but you, you, if you reach 15, 15. Now if you reach 15. <laughs> I go reach 15. Yeah, yeah. This, is, this one inspired our TSM question. And yeah, <laughs> we're looking forward to seeing the... Uh, Titi tried, uh, yes. Titi maybe even yeah. tried to get into two million. That's not easy. Uh -uh. And I like sure. that they pulled out when they yes. did because some people don't know that this is the person we know. Yeah. So, you know, it's for me intellectual. Because uh, uh, this other guy, you know, in 1964, Le was one Leko Le and uh, what's her name? Leko and the other lady, I forgot her name. It was for me intellectual. So, uh, Bolale, Bolale, Bolale yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I took a picture of her earlier. Leko said, his room is not the father, the father is the. <laughs> <laughs> Wahala. All right, guys, that was who wants to be a millionaire. Let's go on a quick break and we'll be back with today's daily top five. There, now uh, me guys are as well. So I saw a video of him and he was he was getting his hair done. Yeah. Uh, and then it was like pink, colors, yeah. green, rainbow colors, blue, and I'm like. Zazu. 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 <laughs> you know see that girl with color water? Water, water. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> All right, welcome back to the show, guys. Uh, consistency is a great characteristic to build and implement in your life. The key to consistency is setting and achieving specific goals. So start by determining how you want to be more consistent in your life and aim for those small goals. Over time, as you become more consistent, keep yourself motivated and accountable because if you want to be successful, you need consistency. And if you don't have it, you've got no chance. Today, as usual, we put together five steps to make sure you're outrageously consistent. This is Daily Top 5. Five, four, three, two, one. Watch me. So, guys, the very first step to being outrageously consistent is for you to have a consistent morning. A morning routine can help you prioritize better, manage your time more effectively, and be more productive. Try meditate for about five minutes. Try reading, stretching, do some exercises and all. It will help you get started in a condition of regulated focus. Yeah. This is uh, very correct. A morning routine mm -hmm. helps with consistency. Mm -hmm. And before you know it, even things that on a normal day you won't be able to do because you have a routine, you will find yeah. yourself doing yeah. those things. Yeah. It, might, it, might, it might not be this pattern. Maybe yeah. yours might not have exercise mm -hmm. in it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yours might have reading your only book in yeah. it. Yeah, just be consistent. <laughs> yeah, and I think it doesn't even just start from that morning. It starts from the night before mm -hmm. because I mm -hmm. find that when before I sleep, I tell myself, once you wake up, you have to do you this. Because sometimes this. you may not wake up in the morning, oh, you just say, whoa, I'm tired this morning, I'm I beg. I want to so face traffic now. You, do you understand? <laughs> start from the night before, you've already told yourself, oh, I need to do this yeah. once mm -hmm. I wake up. Sometimes. Like when I want to, when the day is, I decide to work out. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> um, it's from the night before that I'll tell myself. So, like in the morning, yes. what of my eye, I'm still asleep. Oh, easy asleep. I'll first use I'm doing sleep. By the time yeah. I wake up, I'll just say, What am I doing? No, but yeah. it's already done. True, very so, true. So, morning routine is very important, especially from the night before. I conquer my sister. Yes, number two on our list, ladies and gentlemen, focus. Focus. <laughs> Some say the meaning of focus is following one course until success. Yes, you know you can spend your whole life dreaming, and dreams are wonderful things. By all means, dream away. But if you want to turn those dreams into reality, you need to transform them into goals. You can build a career, get in shape, run marathons, publish a book, invest in a business, have children, and travel the world at the same time. Mm. So focus on this first. Yeah, I'm done with this. 
Mm. Now I want to do this. Mm. Now I want to do this, so that it doesn't clash in your brain. Mm. Mm. Some people brain off your career. It's where Catherine is looking at me because Catherine <laughs> just like after the video me I posted this. No, you, you, the video you I posted this weekend. But that, so that's the thing. Like, I do for, a yeah. lot of things, but then I pick this time yes. is yes. love time. This time yes. is paint time. This time is yeah because I find that if you don't focus, like um, sometimes when I'm painting. I'll just leave the painting and go and be doing that thing. Then I never end up finishing yeah. it. So I focus on that one till I'm done before I start to do something else. So focusing is very important. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Another point is that you should write it down. Yes. When you finance a new car, for instance, or you sign loan agreements committing to pay for it, then you're reminded every month to keep your promise. Yeah. So try writing them down because trust us, these things tend to fly out of your head, oh, yeah. especially if you do several things at a time. In fact, make it a habit to write a lot of stuff down. It kind of helps you be accountable. Mm -hmm. And then uh, apart from accountability, it also helps you. I know people who have written things like they have this little notebook they take everywhere and every time an idea or something pops in their head just, they write it down. Just down and the funny thing is they wouldn't need it, need it at that point but when they would use it mm -hmm. it's, it's more like the past helping your future yeah okay so i'll say this uh not trying to do adverts for anybody um yeah but the mobile device phone. that i use yes. comes with a pen yes so i literally see if you open it in there is i should have written you i should have been on auto by now <laughs> just pull out my pen like this like, the next thing pa, 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 pa. so sometimes it might not even be paper yeah. sometimes you can actually just just yeah. things and there are people that actually have phones that can do this but they don't all they use it to do is to struggle Feature. with uh, Santa. Uh, app store. Yeah. <laughs> let's, not, let's not name names. <laughs> yes, Thank check you. it out the next one. Number four, have a long term vision. The definition of a long term vision here is either how you would like to be ultimately remembered uh, for your work or the ultimate outcome you would like to achieve. Don't settle for an ego boost right now. Just have a vision and just move on. Yeah, ahead. so yes. long-term goals are very um, important, but yes, I've, le I've learned to break them down. So if you're somebody who has anxiety and is starting to think, wow, I'm trying to be this kind of person, da, 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 da. start from the little small things True. leading up to that, but then mm. just know that that's where you're going. Because if mm -hmm. you say, I'm going to buy a house in the next 10 years, that can look very daunting to you, but then start to... Lady Foundation I'm still to getting my private jet. jet. Yes, okay. in the next... Matt Black. In the next... They don't need to donate. Okay. Uh, Please, I'll go, give for, you side go mirror. for me. I'll give you side mirror for the press. <laughs> so, the, the air freshener. Back to <laughs> Anyway, for those of you who are doubting what OJ is saying, no, that leads us to the next point. Mm -hmm. Don't let self-doubt creep in. Yeah. You see, you know the doubt in self, no doubt. <laughs> you know doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will, right? So while you're walking towards your destination, you may experience self-doubt. So let it be at the back of your head not to dwell on self-doubt until you have completed all the processes to achieve your goals. Take action. Try to stop comparing. Beware of your close circle because they can actually mar or make you. Practice self-compassion and always remember your past achievements. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is actually key mm -hmm. because remembering your past achievements is a reminder that You've done this in the past, then you can do this yeah. if you set yourself to it. And trust me, you'll be going places. And yeah. you have to walk you have to walk towards where you're going. Yeah, to so do I'm working for my private church. By donation. As I'm working here. <laughs> but donation. <laughs> will, will I not buy a private church working here? So will you buy my private boss is, are you No, listening? no, no, I can I can get you something like I can talk to your girl. Yes. Miss Fenty. Please so that, talk so to that's, her. That's not that's she just saying. Let me help your life as my girl. Dala don't talk with you, man. No, just like that. Okay. Okay, talk to me. Talk to her. From now, you can't be treating me anyhow on the show again. Let me yes. just tell you that. Hey, hey, excuse me. Yes. Dreadlocks. You bless you. You won't make a call. See, Dala. Maybe they come at you for inside. Dala, excuse you, me. See, see, see. You don't need to excuse stress me. yourself. Don't remove shoe. Just tell him. I'll tell Fenty. I'll tell Robin. I'll tell, I'll tell, I'll tell Rihanna. Just call any I'll, name. I'll, I'll tell I'll tell Robin. No, they come off you again. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, that is all we have got for you on a daily top five. Truth Syndrome Monday is up next. It's going. Says it's going. It's going. It's all going. Right. This is a tune, man. Yeah, yeah. brand new single from uh, Spino and Ashake. Palazzo. And uh, so it, it's, it was the boss scene for me I with the that. lights and with that. I'm like, okay. So I, Ash, I, I've, I've noticed something now. Any video that. So they always have all those Ashake people with the hairstyles. Yes. <laughs> they wear that yes. boss too. Are you I'm, sure we're not in the boss? 
<laughs> just asking yeah. alright guys it's time for Truth Syndrome Monday and today we want to know how well you trust your favorite celebrity <laughs> based on their intellect wow that is why we are asking if you were to go for who wants to be a millionaire game show with a Nigerian celebrity based on the person's intelligence <laughs> what they're having upstairs wow who would you go with and why mm. Lady uh, Cards OJ <laughs> um Kindly. Let me, let me. Uh, maybe Zazu will fight Frank. Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Maybe he just that. dash you the money. Because he does not play with his yeah. money. Okay, with me. Um, Burner Boy looking at uh, his lyrics and the concept behind most of his songs looks mm -hmm. like somebody that will be vast in politics, vast in music. And of course, the mashup he does with old beats, uh, mm. I think. But majorly, if I'm to pick one, it has to be Emma Yabaga. Mm. Um, I will never, I will never forget the day. Emma, Emma used this line, uh, yeah, from his talk about his album, his first album, and he said, "I'm an editor with no footage. What shall I render?" And that was just a line that I said. Oh, no, no, no. It was later when I started doing TV proper that editors before they walk. They you got surrender of footage now. Nah. Yeah. So for a rapper to come up with that line from there, I just said, this guy is damn smart. He's having wisdom. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So am I, and looking at his song catalogs too and the way he writes, yeah. so am I most definitely, and even sitting down with him and having conversations once in a while too, mm -hmm. is that smart. So am I for me, for a rapper to come up with that line? That one first bust my head. From talking about it, oh, yeah, that one bust my head. So am I a bagger for me? Because hey. we go win millions. Uh, we go win million. Like how many million? If you reach that kind of two million, with my wisdom, and I don't get wisdom. Sorry, sir. Uh, 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 and, uh, and my wisdom. <laughs> All right, yeah. Lady Calf. Uh, to be very honest, <laughs> maybe. Okay, my please. Maybe Fal's the bad guy. Fal's the bad guy. Okay. Maybe because I think he's smart. Sorry. Lawyer. Okay, the romantic winner. Lawyer. Yeah, lawyer. Yeah. He knows. A uh, bit of politics. He knows about law and a couple of other things. And he said it several times that he's well versed in a couple mm. of other things. Bragging rights already. Of course. So I'm like, you better come and show you that you have the bragging <laughs> right to. Because if you are going to be bragging, which musician has won the MVC from the beginning, yeah. and then now where you are right now, and ah, then you better win me some millions. <laughs> okay. So how, like, how many million do you think that? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, fast go use laugh. According to his, <laughs> according to his bragging rights, let's say if we can win ten million, but let's just talk as normal people and say maybe one or two millions, and then if we pass there, we pass yeah. the threshold. Okay, um, so the person I would pick to take for um, who wants to be a millionaire that I feel like based on his intellect would be Ike Osaki Odua. Mm. I say this because Ike, first of all, he's very versed. Yeah. Like, he's, he's, he's been in the industry for yes. so long. He, I mean, he's done That's all the child. top shows. Yep. So he's had to know things about all these things. He's done international shows as well. Yes. So if they're asking about locations and all that, I'm sure he'll know. He travels a lot. Mm -hmm. So I'm very sure that based on that, he'll know. Music, if it's children's, if, if it's yeah. movies, Jonathan, if it's movies, yeah. he knows. If it's music, he knows. If it's like a children's type, like who wrote this he book knows. type thing, I know that his wife uh, runs a children's yeah. party. Mm -hmm. So I feel like he would know. Like, ah, so I could do it. Dad, I don't want you to tell me that, already. See, I got, you look oh good. Hey. So I feel like we can get to maybe like seven, maybe like seven. Eight million, mm -hmm. that kind of thing. I feel like he can get me that. Yeah, I actually concur with you. And he has intelligent conversations with people, all especially the people time. he just met. See, like you can meet time. IK for the first time, and the way the conversation will spiral from how are you to, or oh, has the industry been to something else, something that you won't talk about with any normal person, like. It's crazy. I feel like there's nothing that he wouldn't have an idea of. Governments, he's hosting uh, big Geeks events too. with all yeah. this, so he knows these people. Yeah. So yes. see, uh, okay, how fast? Blessing that Allah don't chop the money. As in Allah don't chop the money. Am I? Where are you at? Come through. Found the bad guy in the building. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, truth, ladies and gentlemen. After this timeout, we'll also love to hear from you watching as the phone lines will be open. We'll also be taking your Facebook and Twitter messages. We are TVC Connect using the hashtag e on TVC. In the meantime, let's find out what people's reaction to our TSM question after this commercial break. TSM, it's truth.
Sandra Monday. First of my pick, if I was to call a partner to who wants to be a millionaire. I feel like he's really, really smart. He's a lawyer, of course. So, and during the interest, you could just see that intellectual side of him. Yeah, about you. She's my favorite person, favorite actress. Fowl's a bad guy. <laughs> I like him. I like him because he's humorous. Like, he makes me laugh. I'll probably go with Bonner Boy. <laughs> well, um, to me, he's like the first Nigerian artist that I really love. So, yeah, I would love to sit down with him on the hot seat. <laughs> Square because I love them, you know. I love them, you know, since then, you know, when they are two together before they separated, you know. So I would love to see them because I love their music, I love everything about them. Yeah, it's only a bona because he's spontaneous, you know. Bola is Odogu, he's the African giant, yes. Now, so and shout out to the outsiders now, uh, repping from day zero, man. He's a Grammy Award winner, so what, what else, man? So that's why it's born out. Lua born out. You already know, man. <laughs> Waje. I like her personality. I like her kind of songs. I groove with them. It's my kind of genre. Faust is smart. I feel like he's smart. Everybody knows that he's smart. Although he plays a lot, but he's smart. So I feel like that was my best bit. To be honest, Nigerian celebrities are not that smart. So, But I think Frank Ado, yeah, the host himself, he's the only smart. No, Well, I think he's like the one smart celebrity I can talk of. Or maybe Nancy Sime, but I mean, the others are. I would love to pick Funka Kindele because she's very talented and she's, she, she has the best to go ahead to do it. I will pick Davido. I like Davido. The reason because he's playful. Davido is very playful, so I just like his kind of person. And I like to be, I like people that play lots. Me, I'm the kind of person that play lots, so play, play, play. Bonner Boy. Uh, I feel he has all it takes. Normally, if I want to say, ah, my look, portable, no, 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 no. Diva Gold. Diva Gold, yeah. That getaway, I only did, they always use for us, for his kids. Always. Always. Even for my next life, I still Diva Gold. Always Diva Gold, forever. Um, I'm, I myself, I'm going to select Faz because I feel he's very intelligent and he's, you know, you understand everything about law and so forth. And he went to school, he graduated. But one person I will know, never choose her is, is Zazu for Kotua. I'll say Whiskey, Whiskey. I just like him just because the way he is, his, his background roots is there. At least started from the roots and all that. Um, I think I'll take Adesua Itomi because she sounds pretty articulate and she feel, I feel like she knows stuff. Ah! Um, for my whole view, all the musicians know no book. They know no book for my eye. Like, even, okay, normal. People where I like will be celebrities, they'll be comedian. But most of them, for my own view, they know no book. But the comedian, I want to say, you know, like, say, small, you say, no book, small. What have you relate to it? Maybe with, with Shanks, if you follow me, go. Because like, I say, no book, small, because the way they, you get. Now nah, only because damn, if he do this stuff, where you get? Ah, now see, see me go no book, oh. She go no book, she go, he see me, he see me, now see, see me, she go no book. I look, and I shape, I shape no book, sorry, I, she go be like, there's no book. I know you are now after you say. <laughs> OJ, OJ is very brilliant. He knows everything, about something about everything. So, OJ, I'm going to pick you, that's why I'm going to pick you, because you know book. You're brilliant. TSM, it's Truth Syndrome Monday. Oh, yeah, you know, I told oh, you that yeah, I will no, pick you. I see. I will you know pick book. you. You know book. You know book. He's very smart. Like, he knows a bit like, of everything. You like say you won't go out with 30k. 30,000! <laughs> <laughs> But, but, but OJ, you're but, smart, yeah. Uh, mm. uh, okay. Yeah. Shout out <laughs> to those people that do not believe that there's any Nigerian. Nigerian celebrity. No. They don't know anything. They don't know no book. I don't know anybody who know anything. Uh, uh. Okay. There's hey. one that said that Nancy is female because she has hey, shape. shape. That she got no book. That she looks like she looks like she got no book. Uh, because of her face. shape. Because of shape. If not by shape, people, they know book. No, All right, no problem. They, Apparently, we, we, we have a lot of comments. But okay, so those geez. of you who are just joining and uh, wondering what happened, uh, geez, that was the TSM. Yeah, that was the TSM question. We asked, if you were to go for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Game Show, 
with a Nigerian celebrity based on the person's intelligence. Yeah. Who would you go with you and say, why? Uh, get Grammy. Uh, <laughs> they're talking about intelligence. Oh, you, but you, you said Bonana. But you no, gave, because, you because gave of his reason. You gave his reason. That's what I said. You gave his reason. Yeah. But say, ah, this person, because I, I like him. Yeah, uh, okay. uh, Olumide 3338807, that's Mide Ketu says, wow. I would go with Ramsey Noah and Fowles asking OJ of Chelsea. Ah, wow. Show you the wine mini. Wow, wow. <laughs> Please. Uh, at T Blaze underscore 10 says, At Frankie Doe will be my choice. And see this connect now into reply. Sharp guy. The guy, the guy I replied, Lagos, not the carry last. So, <laughs> like, but why not just take the host? No, but you actually can't go with the host, Dave, even, because even, he'll be hosting yeah, the show. It's even crazy that the, this new one, there's that, that usual phone a friend or yeah, ask the ask audience. The, yeah. Instead, you ask, ask the, the host, host. And I watched like two episodes that says, I, don't, I can't see the answer here. But based on, there was one that he got wrong. Yes. Mm -hmm. Is that based on what I know? I know. If it be this one. But don't take my word for it to... What is it? So Frank, Frank. don't say, no, no. Forget you know, it. Enough it to know. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, many more. We have a lot. Uh, Chibuke Samuel says, Brother Shaggy. Uh, and TV's going to reply, that's definitely going to be a hilarious segment. <laughs> I think the first segment will be hilarious. Yeah. Uh, Nikki Flory says, at Apro Good Doctor... Uh, someone hey. replied to TV Connect, that's the mm. goal. Um, at Obey Bayon Lee says, I would have preferred Gabriel for Lion, not because he's my favorite Nollywood artist, but because of his choice of words in movies and his lyrics in his songs, which can invariably translate to a level of tension. Mm. The script they give him. Not script, no. For movie I they give him. I thought of somebody else I can take. Who? Mm. Patrick O'Brien. Frank said that's the wrong answer. <laughs> it's my dear, now nah, he's true. Nah, it's not by it. English. At hey. O underscore Sarah says, official Naramali one. Hmm. Okay. Okay, um, let me run to Facebook why do to own? see what's going there. Um, what I do own for Naramali? Um, so, on we Facebook, are, my people. <laughs> <laughs> on Facebook, I have uh, Afuda <laughs> Baba Agbalagba, who says, I'm going with Lekong. And then there's like a long conversation under this. Let me look they use that. Jamie Tokwe says, same here. Ebere Chukwu is like, that's one. Did you watch last two weeks? <laughs> Flawless Blaze now say, did you watch last week's episode? Yeah, the other celebrity won 500K, the lowest so far yeah. in Who Wants to Be a Millionaire Edition. Elise now said, oh, the ladies answered most, if not all the questions. You just sat there smiling sheepishly. <laughs> Be careful I, I, who I, you I chose. I don't hey, Don't disrespect. I hmm. Okay, mm. I don't. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> Hope well, Oriata says, I'll go with my prof, Sir Wale Shoinka. If they ask and that TVC responds, they say, let this man rest now. If they ask, if they <laughs> ask Wale Shoinka, who is the Nigerian musician popularly known as David Adeleke or Damini Obulu? Inogo Nwam. Hmm. Or Ayobalogu, Inogo Nwam. So that's so. how you have to calculate your answer. Yeah, as in. Yeah. Okay, we have Ijeoma, Vivian, um, Mbanugo, Ebenezer. They said, I'll go with Simi. Okunuwa hmm? Shei Fumi said, I'll go with Gabriel Afolayo because he's smart and intelligent. You guys mm. are looking good. Thank you. Sandra Felix mentioned three people. Your favorite actor, Ramsey Noah, <laughs> Babaji De Otizoju, uh, and Kemi Adetiba. Iwaeze said V. Olu Amos Oni said Teju Baby Face, straight 100. Hmm. Abdul said, hashtag splash on TVC. See that guy, where they your middle. <laughs> we are going to be in that hot seat together. 30K for you. Ah! <laughs> And Kali Crown, Omoni said, I'll go for Ibuka Obi Uchendu because he's highly intelligent, smart. Mm. I feel he's very educated and he knows a lot because I'm always inspired whenever I watch him speak on media. So mm. I don't know if I should feel insulted or I should just, let me just read it. Don Great says, does any of the regular celebrities have sense? If I were to choose my own celebrity, it would be Mr. Reno Omokri. And Emeka says, absolutely, you're so on that. point. Rachel says, Reno all the way. And Shomide says, I follow you on this. Because of all those... That is to um, weigh, weigh in on. All right, so we have a yes. caller. We have Joy. Hello, Joy. Good afternoon. Good, Good afternoon. afternoon. How are you? Weekend and how is the week going? Very Great, fine. Thank, thank you. you. So you guys look so good. Oh, <laughs> thank you, thank Joy. you. So, which celebrity would you want on the hot seat with you? Uh, I'm going to choose Wale Shurika. At least in no book. Wale Shoinka. Oh, Professor Wale Shoinka. the celebrities. I, I can Joy. go for that one. Joy. Well, Hello. Joy. 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 Hello. Joy. Joy. Hello. Joy, can you hear me? Okay, what's happening? If they ask, <laughs> if they ask, if they ask, 
Professor Wole Shoinkang mm -hmm. now. Who is the musician yeah. known as David Aleleke? Igo get him. Who is, is the one? Who is that Nigerian musician that is so, his real name is David Adeleke? Well, let's show you how You say you don't fit. He go now. Or Yusuf, you don't know. Joy. Uh, I know now that David don't know. Well, let's show you how you <laughs> you should say you said false. Hey, <laughs> she's not friends. Thank you right, so thanks. much, Joy. Uh, Lady Kaz, I think you were reading something. Yeah, yeah. so Charles AK says, I'll go with Jim Ike. Sense, no go kid that guy, Sha. Jim Ike. Hey. Jim Ike. Nah, slap go kill you. <laughs> mm. But on later, I will says, I will go with Lolo X, Big Brother, and your housemate, or Shei Awolawa. <laughs> and we have a lot of comments. Yes, and we're going to be taking more of those comments. I'm saying so much craziness here. We'll be with Rana and more. But we're going to give you all of that right after this break. <laughs> <laughs> All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Before that break, you already know it's still True Syndrome Monday, and we asked the question, if you were to go for who wants to be a millionaire game show with a Nigerian celebrity, based on the person's intelligence, who would you go with? I said, am I a bad guy? Lady Cat says, Faust the bad guy. Dala says, I.K. Osaki Odua, and the <laughs> comment section on Twitter Man, before we went on Facebook break. is crazy. Hey, Abigail Clapton hmm. on Facebook said, Our dear polymath earrings. Oh, oh wow. Earrings. True. But would earrings know about me? So he likes to know a bit about everything. Everything, yeah. So he, he could know the music. He could know. I don't think that's a bad answer. Yeah. No, Yaris. it's not bad. Yaris. Actually, actually, actually someone on this uh, comment by Jeremiah Ovie Eba Isaac who says, David Do, because he has what it takes. Blessing now said, <laughs> if it fail, when will I come out? It go balance up the amount. Chai, you two get sense, Jerry. <laughs> Jeremiah I, I, said, no dolly, my sister. I think I saw one on Facebook too. And one of our camera guys in the studio, I just says, Davido. Yeah. And the guy says, Davido, because if you eventually know where they Yes, now you're balanced it will, up. He will give you the money straight ah. up. So, David, I think that's an intellectual move. Yes, yeah. it Not is. Not for the brain. Yeah, <laughs> but for your money. Secure the bag, Just my brother and my sister. Move. Yeah, so, that's why it's... Uh, on Twitter, man. God damn it. We have a lot. A uh, lot. Uh, hmm. Director Filmboy says, at Sony Abraham, one, yeah. Uh, at Collie Crown says, I would love to go with Daniela Gray because he has a unique personality mm. and he's also smart looking. Okay, for question... Um, at Olamide of Lag says Titi on TVC Wake Up Nigeria. She's super intelligent. Yeah, Titi did well on that particular edition. Represented, yeah. represented well. We get brain. Yeah, at I am underscore Henry Kovic says Mrs. Joker Silva. Mm. And Ooh. he went on saying Alingua Shago Sabi. <laughs> A lingua she go sabi book according to Kiki Romeli. <laughs> based on uh, the the I, I, I guess uh the, yeah so I think <laughs> based on a lingua hmm. and someone has called Jay says Titi because she's super intelligent. Titi don't judge a lot. As hmm. uh, uh, at Bodman OJ says Titi Oyinso she's intelligent, vast and dynamic. Uh, at Owo Owo Niyi LB says at Kanayo Kanayo what high level of intellectuality. Of what? Like Kanayo, Kanayo. Okay. okay. Uh, uh, we have we have a call on the line. Glory. <laughs> Glory, how far now? Hello, okay. How far? How are you? I'm good though. So which celebrity well, will you pick I'm, to? I'm, I'm feeling you people. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> So, it's like made my day every day. Oh, oh, thank so you. So which celebrity will you love to go on who wants to be a millionaire with based on their brain? Doyle. Why? He looks brilliant. He looks intelligent. Mm. Okay. Okay. And whiskey. He's, Why? He's calm. And eh. talk less. Eh. So he should be intelligent. Glory, you don't eh. mind me. Whiskey. Ah. Uh, whiskey. Ah. He looks calm. Okay. Right. Right. That's six. That talk, that talk less to be intelligent. Mm. No problem. And you're a kid doll. Mm. No problem. Combination. Mm. You go mad. Three million. Ah, <laughs> millions. Right. Thank, Thank you. you so according to this calculation, I'm like, I can like Oga Sabinus. He will just... Talk less. He will just, he will just check the answer. Say... Since this one, I am B. Mm -hmm. That's C. Go be like, go plan <laughs> How does the question where they use for industry ah. that year? 30, 30K for you. Yeah. Okay, so we have Emanuela Rosemary Obenta who said, I will go with Senator Dino Melai. Because you can't defeat him. He knows all the technicality in games playing. Lol. 
O L. Um, Jill Augustine said, "I'll go with portable. Ten K is something." Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Why are you there? Wow. Now you guys are so. Ooh, Adela, you have delight. Said I'm going with Honey P. Oh. Okay, Honey Pot in the building. And she's this morning. She will, she's this she will, morning she will, now. She'll do the video. She'll balance it. Hmm. She'll balance it. All up. right. So I have uh, Ariad Bless who says I'll go with Ariad Ferry, aka Voice of Thunder. Okay. Wow. Uh, Latifat Badamosi says which Wale Shoyinka and Teju Baby Face. Atinu Katik says I'll definitely go with Taiwo Ajayi Lyset. I didn't care Solomon Ogunleti says, I'll go with Files. Mm -hmm. Fatai Mustafa says, Nazazu ago kari go. <laughs> Ogundele Kende and Patience Bruce both say, Files the bad guy. Shoyemi Zainab Abolanle says, it will be Omani Oboli, intelligence plenty. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So many comments. Another person says, uh, Georgina says, I'll definitely go with Files the bad guy. His IQ is top notch. I'm so going with Files the bad guy. He's smart Less and intelligent. Files smart. As in, man, okay. I'm just seeing Files so everywhere. So I actually found somebody that actually said, August Sabinus as well. Olamide said, I'm going with August Sabinus. That man, a tactician. He could analyze the answers. If, even on Twitter, I hear this. Eric is savage. One says, I'll choose Sabinus. Yeah. So this person said, although I show CFC said I'll go with Joe Boy. Hmm. I don't I don't know. I don't see Joe Boy talking. Why don't a lot. you know? Because I don't see him talk a lot. From so I'm not sure. He'll give lyrics so, so I'm not sure what he knows. Talkers. No, me, I don't know. <laughs> let's talk as they They know they know. Um, so Summer Prince said, I'm surely going with Chimamanda, Ngozi Adichie, and Brain Jota. That's what we're allowed to. Ngozi, obviously, because she's incredibly smart and intelligent, and I'm assured of going on with a million. Brain Jota, on that one seat, I'll be needing a little bit of craziness and humor. But if it's only one we're allowed, I'll definitely go with Faust the bad guy. Smartness and humor overload. Mm -mm. Um, Kaka Adolf Nonso said, I'll go with Pastor Chris Okote. He knows art, science, technology, commerce, literature, theology, entertainment, politics, law, geography. That man is vast, fiercely. Mm -hmm. yeah, wow. Good choice. Uh, Paka, Paka Kali says, good day, gang. If I were to go for who wants to be a millionaire game show with a Nigerian celebrity, based on the person's intelligence, I will go with Ikem Owo, a.k.a. Mm. Sophia. Ah. And why? Because he's very wise with his words and also funny. Okay. I'll agree. I'm seeing a lot of I'll go with OJs for the yeah. record. OJ, you get fans. OJ, you get fans. You get Ten fun. case, I don't, case I, don't, I don't know book like that. Bro. Ten case, somebody will go with Daddy Freeze. <laughs> Isaac Baba Eko hey. and Bashanun Hassan Purposel will go with Daddy Freeze. Honestly, that man is controversial but intelligent. Yeah, right. Mm. Drees <laughs> underscore XY says, Am I a bagger? Uh, Mary That's Alabi says, Hi guys, I'm so lovely to see you on the Dynamite from last episode. Ooh. Then I will take Professor Wallen Shoika and Jokel Silva now to win 20 MO. Uh, Ulua Damoshi says, Portable, <laughs> are you losing focus? So, see this uh, one I saw. Abdishola Raman yeah. says, Emaya Baga. Rafael um, Eremon Sele Ikeli says, Elon Musk, oh, we know win. He go balance me, buy the show. Yeah. He know day, he know first day, Adam. He buy everything. Yep, and to wrap it up, um, Agumbi Ade Abdul Rahman said, I'm going with Vector. I think Vector is another Vector. smart person. I don't know yeah. why people haven't mentioned Vector him. Vector show could see yes. run. They're so right. very They're smart deep. people. I think that is what we're going to say. Because yeah. people that say that Nigerian celebrities don't yeah. have See, you don't know what they know, to be <laughs> honest. So, the line 20 seconds. I actually forgot today is my friend's birthday. I just want to wish a happy birthday. Ban Justin Misola. Happy birthday to you, darling. Happy I wish birthday. you the very best. Happy birthday. All right, guys, that is all we can take. Thank you all so much for your messages. Thank you for your calls. That was actually very fun, oh, wow. to be honest. Ah. We couldn't take everyone, but go to our Facebook page yes. and go and check out all the comments that day. You are going to laugh. Somebody said Pite Doche. I think so many crazy answers. Um, thank you all for tuning in. We're going to be here tomorrow telling you about the movies. And um, I was on the show, your girl, Dalai Kate, Goddess of Skills. OJ Orange Juice was also in the building. And of course, Lady Cat. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Love you. Bye. I'm